Hey guys, Adam Fennig here with Fennig Equipment. You're tuned into the Talking Shed, and today we're going to go over the components that make up a Raven rate controller. So not only a rate controller, but what makes your rate work? How do you get that to run, and uh, how do you get to that magic number that you're looking for without this thing beeping at you? So I want to start off with the console. Of course, obviously, I hope that you have a Raven 440 or 450 console or else you wouldn't be watching this video. Let's go to the back side of it. This is a fuse right here. So if you ever have power issues, check that fuse. This is your speed input. It's a three pin. It'll thread right into there. Now I'm gonna tell you something right now about that speed input. That does not provide power. If you need power, you're gonna to have to get it out of one of these two wires right here or somewhere else. This does not provide power to your speed input. This plug is what we call our console cable. It provides power to the rate controller. You can see our red and white wires here hooked up to this battery. We've got a fuse in line. This will tie in either to the battery of your tractor or your three pin round plug or the rectangle three pin spades, uh, depending on what you have in your tractor. But we have to give this power, of course. Um, on the power, when you enter in all your information into this controller and you turn it on and off, you will not lose your power. Um, the only way to lose power is to do a clearing like we've talked, hold down the CE button and turn it on and that will erase all of your data. So that's that. Um, I wanna go through the components and, and how they all work. So this is our product harness. The product harness plugs into the console harness right here. Um, the product harness is where all the magic happens. So we've got our flow meter tied into our flow meter cable. We've got three sections. These are also made in five section booms as well. And then we've got our standard control valve. This valve is the valve that's gonna sit there and do the butterflying to increase or decrease your rate based on your speed and so it will uh, do that for us. So those are the components when we run through this and some things to remember on the controller. We've got the flow meter. The only thing really missing, I guess, would be your section valves, if you have section valves of any sort. And then this is just the butterfly flow meter. So those are the components. If you're either looking to buy a Raven setup or you need parts, uh, you can refer to this video and uh, give us a call. Thanks for tuning in.